Hey guys, we're going to do some isometrics for our shoulder to work on our um, supraspinatus range. So this is uh, one of your rotator cuff muscles and we're using it to try and strengthen that range. A lot of people may have some uncontrolled range through their useless flexibility so they don't actually control it or they just have overuse and their supraspinatus needs some work. So a lot of people's shoulder impingement can have this issue. Okay, so we're going to do some isometrics. The range where supraspinatus tends to work is from about here to just above 90. So you're going to do these isometrics throughout that range. And what I want you to do is I want you to do contractions where you push down and push up with resistance in that range at about 15 to 20 degree in increments. So if we start down here around that range, I'm going to use a dowel back a bit so you can see. And then I'm going to be keeping my arm, I want to be square myself up so I'm not overcompensating or I'm not rounding forward nice and tall. Keep the shoulders back and down. And I'm in this range here. I'm going to push down into the ground, hold that for 10, 15 seconds. Good, hold, hold, hold. And then we're gonna do the opposite. So we've done 15, 20 seconds. We're gonna do the opposite. I'm gonna push up, but I'm meeting the resistance with my hand here. So I'm going up, 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 up. Good. And you hold that for 15, 20 seconds. Relax. Now we're gonna go into the next one where you're gonna go in another 15, 20 degrees. So we're gonna work here. And you keep going through. So you do your 10, 20 seconds down, 10, 20 seconds up. Make sure you resist up and resist down so we don't have any movement, it's isometric. And then we can work another one at about 90, same thing. And then if we wanna work on this range just above, we're gonna push down and then you can resist up into your hand. You can also do the seated so then you could get all the way up the dowel, okay? You wanna do that through the range, so there's about four. So from here to about here, and there's about four or five every 15, 20 degrees. Once you have control and strength through that range, then we will actually control it. So actually strengthening through that range, you'll control the entire range, okay? So that's isometrics for your supraspinatus. Take care.